This video just want to give you a quick pulse on the competitive meta last night. First tournament of the year, Sim Ghost over on the Gulag. Shout out to Slim, runs the, some of the best midweek tournaments in the Mad community. I really enjoy what he's been doing over the last couple of years in the Gulag. Um, my man K Rich on Twitter, I think he's a must follow if you're looking to get better at Madden and just learn um, what the competitive community is doing. Really got some great analysis from him here on the schematics for the competitive Madden meta. And I uh, just wanted to highlight a couple of things for you guys real quick. And uh, it's basically this. He says, of the 32 players playing in the first gulag, I was able to gather 26 out of 32 players' defenses to see what they were doing early on in Madden 24. DB Fire 2 is still the second most used defense. Now, I want to caveat that with what you're going to see in this graph. But out of 335 wide, when sending five is capable of getting a gap pressure, we have a full 335 uh, wide or 33 cub is what it's called in Madden 24. Um, we have a full ebook on the Patreon right now that breaks this defense down in detail as to why it's the number one defense in the game. You can get access to that by joining the Patreon today for just 10 bucks. The link is going to be down in the description below. He says, when that defense is able to uh, get a gap pressure, it is the heavy favorite of most competitive players on the defensive side of the ball as we head into ladders. Again, this defense was literally out for us. We dropped this night one of Madden 24. So here's the actual graph that explains the defenses that were being utilized. This nickel 245 B-Nog scheme, honestly, like I'm really surprised that three people even ran this because the clear cut uh, better version of this would have been, I guess B-Nog is probably better than 245. But anyway, bottom line is a small minority of people we're running a dollar two minute or loop, which video on that is coming later today. We actually have that blitz already in the Patreon for you guys. We have a whole ebook that teaches the best blitzes in the game every single year. But the other thing that I want to show you here is 6-1. There was two people running it. Defensive ebook on that coming later as well. I've uh, been working on that kind of behind the scenes. I do think 6-1 has some play this year. Dime normal, only two people ran dime normal. And here's your meta right here. It was dollar DB fire two. Now, there is a new way to run DB Fire 2. It's a kind of a new way that we're going to be breaking down in our dollar defensive ebook, which we'll be dropping uh, shortly as well. But the, the overwhelming majority of people were in nickel 335 wide or 335 cub or 33 cub is, is what it's called in, in this year's game. Here's the bottom line. Um, 33 cub provides you a lot of opportunity defensively to do a lot of different things. One of the, Only one big piece of that is the blitzing. Blitzing is only one big piece of that. The other thing that you can do with 3-3 Cub is it's really good at containing mobile quarterbacks. It's really good at stopping the run. In this year's Madden, you have to be prepared to stop the run defensively. Also, 3-3 Cub poses the best adjustments you can possibly get on the defensive side of the ball and the ability to play man coverage, match coverage, and zone coverage. I predicted 3-3 Cub would be the day one meta for Madden 24 um, a couple of weeks ago in my Patreon. I actually gave a 45-minute explanation as to why 3-3 Cub is as good as it is going to be in this year's game. I think 3-3 Cub is poised to be the best blitz for the majority of the year and the best overall defense because of its ability to not only get really good pressure, but, and they really can't patch the pressure. They can patch the A-gap portion of the pressure, but the pressure is always going to be there. We actually show you how to get that A-gap pressure in our ebook, even if they block a running back or a tight end. So you have that, but the other big piece of this is the other big piece of 3-3 Cub being the number one defense in Madden is what you can do from an adjustment concept, okay? And it's ability to contain mobile quarterbacks. Because you have linebackers, uh, because you have safeties at linebacker and you're audibly into it from nickel 3-3, you are then able to adjust those linebackers and crossman them. And I'm telling you right now, we're going to do more about this in a in an ebook to come. Cross manning in Madden 24 is going to be the best way to play defense. Uh, you, you heard it here first. It's really good. Cross man this year is really good. Um, it's better than it was last year, and last year is pretty good. So uh, that is just kind of like a quick pulse on the competitive meta. Really loved this tweet. Uh, from K Rich, he does a lot of good videos. He actually, does some real NFL videos as well. He's kind of a a, a strategy guy or a now like an analyst, and uh, I think he does great work. He said that he's going to have another tweet out here um, about uh, about offense. So just want to do a quick video talking about the meta, why it's so good. If you guys want to get the three three Cub defensive ebook, the links in the description. Patreon members get everything. You get everything by being a member. So you'll get the dollar two man under loop blitz that we already put in there. We have a one four six defensive ebook in there. We're dropping a six one ebook. We're going to be dropping a big nickel ebook. 
Um, and we're going to drop a dollar ebook, of course. I was working on the dollar one last night. So a lot of stuff. We've already got eight offensive and defensive ebooks available. We're dropping uh, two or three more today. My goal is by the end of the first week of Madden 24 to have 15 offensive and defensive ebooks available, as well as many updates for you so that you're always on top of what the competitive meta is. Thanks for watching the video, guys. To sign up for the Patreon, head down to the description and uh, go join up. It's really a great deal. Ten bucks, you get all that stuff. Uh, super good, and you'll get everything as long as your membership is active. You'll always have access to everything.